So you might be trying to figure out how you can add songs to your Samsung Galaxy Watch when you can listen to them without the phone. Now, doing this is actually very, very basic. The very first thing you're going to want to do is you want to start off with your Android device. So make your way over to your Galaxy Wearable Watch application. So go and make your way over to Samsung Wearables, which is right here. And what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to first download a song or download songs onto our phone. So you can download the MP3 files, whichever thing you want to do. It's very basic, so just download the song that you want to do and manage. And what we're going to want to do here, once we have the songs on our device, we're going to scroll down until we, in our Galaxy Wearable Watch application, until we see Watch Settings. So tap on Watch Settings right here. And what we're going to want to do here is we basically want to scroll down until we see something that says Manage Content. So click on Manage Content right there. And then write this very first option right here that says Tracks on Watch. All you're going to want to do is tap on that little option that says that. Now, when you click on that, you'll come into this next page. And what this page is going to basically tell you is, it's going to show you or tell you all the songs that you have on your, on your Galaxy Watch currently. But if you want to add a song, you can click on that plus button right up here. So tap on the plus button, and you will start to see all the songs available that you can actually add. So from here, you can see these songs, it says to add tracks faster, you can turn on locations or whatever. But from here, you can go and see what other songs you have and even other folders you have. And from here, whatever songs you have available on your device, from here, you can just tap on it just like this, and you can click Add to Watch. So now, it's going to start connecting to watch. I guess my watch isn't even on or not connected, which is weird, so I'm going to click Retry. I guess if it's, guess if it's still not working, it's still not working. So it says allow the permission, so I have to actually give it permission. So we're going to have to do that. So from here, you're going to want to just view permissions and you're going to want to probably give it permission right here. So click allow, and then you click allow again, and it should be able to just do it again. So let's click retry. As you can see, the song is going to be sending. And from here, after a few moments, you should be able to then make your way over. As you can see, it's working. Once it's done, you then want to go ahead and make your way over to your Galaxy wearable. So your Galaxy watch, whatever you have. And what you're going to want to do here is swipe up and you want to make your way over to your music application. So right here is the music icon. So tap on music, and then you should be able to see that all the songs that we just basically used before should be available. So now what we can do is we can swipe through this whole entire application, and we should be able to play songs from our specific device now. And that's basically it. So here you can click on library, and you can see all the songs available, and you should be able to see tracks, and we should have two, which is this one and the same exact one from before. So that's pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.